snake in your state. Yeah, this is Nate once again from Nate in your state. I'm here at another location. I am going to the modern vegan. I, I don't know what to say, man. It's, it's just it's just real hot in Vegas. One of the ways I'm trying to get around is by Ubering everywhere. Because you know you get the comfort of AC in the car and you don't have to walk too far to a bus station and you know be in the sun for too darn long. So yeah, let's go into Modern vegan behind me and um, get some breakfast. This menu is pretty beast. I'm like real eager to eat everything, so I really do like how they just tell you up front here's a prize and here's everything that goes along with the prize. Prize, everything that goes along with it. Ooh, that's cool. <laughs> I like that. You know, there's a prize and everything that goes with it. So pretty much you just you know what you're, what you're getting. The lowest amount of things is like five dollars. So the steak and veg was the first thing I had on the menu and it was for fifteen dollars. It came with grilled sea tin strips with scrambled tofu and it also came with some baked potatoes with their special TMV sauce that they put in the middle. My first impressions of it, I like the potatoes more than I like the scrambled tofu and the seating strips. It wasn't bad, but one of the issues that I had with it, it was very salty, and I was having trouble enjoying it completely. It was good, but the salt overwhelmed the entire meal, and I wasn't really feeling it per se, but it was good. As for desserts, one of the desserts I had that intrigued me was the I love you. It's quite funny because um, when I asked for um, I love you, one of the waitresses said I love you back. I said, oh gosh, don't make me blush here. But the I love you, is, it's a banana split. It's a deep fried banana with ice cream, peanuts, cherries, strawberry syrup, whipped coconut cream, and chocolate sauce. It was, it was really delicious as well. And I enjoyed the desserts, the sweets that I had. Uh, this sweet was actually for $10. All the sweets are for $10. Now, what I really need to tell you guys about is the chicken waffles. Chick apostrophe N waffles. This, this dish, my goodness. I had to come back another day to really try something else on the menu. But this dish, I tell you ladies and gentlemen, this dish took my breath away. It was served with tempeh bacon, with mashed potatoes and asparagus, Canadian maple syrup and vegan butter. And I tell you, it was so good. So good to the point that you can actually see my eyeballs roll back. And then, if we can repeat that so many times with my eyes being rolled back, that's how you know that the dish is good. And it made sense how everything complemented each other with the mashed potatoes, the slice of the waffle, and the vegan chicken. Uh, it, it was incredibly good. It made no sense how good this was to the point that if any meat eater was to try it, their taste buds would be just as confused as mine. And this was quite the dish. This is the one dish I recommend any meat eater who wants to try vegan food and is in Las Vegas. You have to try the chicken waffles. It is off the charts. It is incredibly delicious. And you have to try chicken waffles when you go to Modern Vegan. Once again, shout out to my vegan friend who recommended this spot to me. Because uh, I was telling her, I said, I, I don't, I'm not really feeling the steak and vets. She says, no, you must try this chicken and waffles. And I don't regret it one bit. Thank you so much, Grace Brown, for this recommendation. And if anybody has any spots that they want me to try out, any recommendations that they want to throw out my way, just feel free to shoot it my way, and I will get back to you later.